my eighth grade promotion. The principal and teachers are handing out academic awards. I and another student, let's call him King Bob, are called to the center of the stage again and again to receive different awards. The night ends. I have earned seven awards, including the American Legion Award, as well as my certificate for completing middle school. Fast forward to the next day at school. Everyone is talking about how King Bob got all the awards, how smart he is, what an overachiever he was. There was no mention of me. At first, I thought maybe it was my fault. Maybe I wasn't trying as hard as King Bob. Maybe he was just better than me academically. It took both a family member as well as a friend pointing it out for me to realize the real reason. He was getting more recognition than me because he was a he. In my community, people are being unintentionally sexist. Earlier this year, I was selling raffle tickets at a basketball game. The boys game was before the girls game. And as the boys game came to an end, I realized almost half of the audience was leaving before the second game could start. I'm sure the girls noticed as they had watched the boys game. And I also knew that they felt discouraged. My school didn't have a girls basketball team last year and they had worked hard to build one this year. The audience who was there to show their support their school spirit and support for the team had done the opposite. A few weeks ago, I was sitting in my Algebra 1 class. I had finished my worksheet for the day when another student, let's call him Larry the Cucumber, Larry the Cucumber turned in his paper. I was the only one done at the time, and soon the other kids were talking about how good he was at math and how quickly he had done the worksheet. I had clearly cleaned off my desk. It was obvious I was done first, but no one mentioned my name. They couldn't see me because I was a girl. Now we'll pick a sport. Let's say basketball. Who here watches men's basketball? Okay. And who here watches women's basketball? Well, at my school, it's not like that. People who watch boys basketball don't watch girls basketball. And why is that? For some, it may be because women's basketball isn't as mainstream as men's. And why is it not as mainstream as men's? The same reason some of you still wouldn't watch the women's league. Because women aren't viewed as as strong, fast, or entertaining to watch as the men's team. And that is sexy. A show of hands, who knew that that was sexist? By not watching. What? By not watching. Yeah. Most of you didn't, right? I believe it is the same way at my school. I don't believe the others know that they are being sexist. And if they did know, I think they would try to change the habit. But this means someone has to speak out and spread the awareness of this inequality plaguing my school. And I am that person. Through the techniques and skill sets I have acquired through FFI, I am ready to speak out and make others hear me. I have learned so much through FFI, and I feel like I have a family within them. And I want to make them proud by doing my best to better my community. I am a part of my school student council, the vice president actually. And I'll be using the student council to help me be heard. An example of this could be organizing an assembly to discuss the issue. And hopefully, through my efforts, my school will become a place where people are happy. A place where people feel safe and confident enough to talk about sensitive issues. A place where everyone is equally recognized. And a place where everyone in the audience stays for both basketball games. In short, a place like FFI. Thank you.